Yo, what is going on guys? Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to exactly um, do cammed. As you guys can tell by the title. So basically, I'm going to show you guys how to do cam. So let me go to a quiet place. Say the construction site actually. So guys, this is legit full working and stuff. I don't know if you can do it in automatic or just normal manual, but I'm doing it in manual with clutch. So yeah. But I'll test it out for you guys over here very soon. Um, I don't know if this works for any other forces, so if you, if you guys mind, try on a Motorsport 5 or something. Alright, so once you are here, right, um, hold on, I'm just eating lifesavers. Alright, so, now, let's actually go somewhere for you. Let me turn off the volume on my PC. Because as you guys can see, I'm recording this on PC. You guys can see the thing. Alright. Go to any place, like any quiet place. Or say you're parked at the thing. Actually, you guys reckon I should go over here? I should actually do it, yeah. That's last trouble. Guys, I promise to you, it actually works. I'm not joking, it actually does work. If you guys don't believe me, then fine, don't believe me. But I'm telling you that it does work. Here, as you guys can see, it's pretty quiet here. All right, so um, let me try this in automatic, and we'll see if oh no, automatic doesn't work. It doesn't work actually. So what we're going to do is try it in manual because automatic it doesn't work in it because if you hold brake, it goes into reverse straight away. Yeah, see, it doesn't work. Yeah, no, wait. See, as you guys can see, it actually holds the clutch, but you're not you're not allowed to do that. That's why I'm telling you guys do it in manual clutch because it actually you actually have the option to hold the clutch or not. So I'm gonna change it back to manual clutch. Alright, so now as you guys can see. See my clutch is on now, that's because as you can see I'm tapping it. And when I hold the handbrake, when I yeah, when I hold the handbrake, it actually does that. Alright. So now let's get to the tutorial. Alright. So what you're gonna have to do, you can do this two ways. With the uh, brakes way or with the handbrake way. So first I'm going to show you with the brake one. Alright, so you know when you normally launch like with like drag races and with your friends like this? And then you actually have to let go of stuff and you like, the gas and stuff and shift. So what you're going to have to do now, you don't have to do that, but you have to actually do that launch thing. But while you're doing it, just hold the brake normally and just keep on tapping the accelerator. As you guys can see, it's camped. Once you do it, it sounds like it's camped. Let me try turning off the thing. Um, settings. Let me turn off the RPM. So now you can only see the map. Alright, so now. As you guys can see, do that, or you can just keep from tapping it like without holding the accelerator. As you guys can see it works. Alright, so now if 
the old handbrake now, it does the same thing. Just without a brake lights on. So yeah guys, that's how you're meant to do it guys, so I'd say you're going up to here. Let's say you come up to here and then you come to a stop and you want to do the cam. So you can press your front. You just do that tutorial. And then once you do it, like once you want to start rolling. Just like hold a tiny bit of gas and let go of accelerator. See, so look, I'll show you guys with the um, analog on. Alright, so now I have it back on. And as you guys can see, I'm holding a handbrake. And if I just hold the handbrake and brake, it does the same thing. Alright, so So let me know what you guys think. I'm going to change cars and show you that it actually works in other cars. So it doesn't really work with one car. Guys, let's see what car I can use. Oh yeah, I can use these and stuff. See, look, I can use this one. This one's like pretty much stock, but the only thing it's upgraded is the race exhaust and pop filter. So basically, I just made it like normal, like for double clutch. Yeah, right, so as you guys can see, it's pretty much stock. Yeah, that's just just for double pleasure. I wonder if you guys want me to teach you guys how to double clutch. Oh, just for the rest of the video, do that. The description below. Alright, so into a quiet place. Get your handbrake up, like hold your handbrake, and keep on like hold it, like hold it till it goes down to uh, two thousand RPM, right? Then you start tapping the accelerator because it sounds more real. See this? See that? So I'll do it again. Another one. Like that. And let me show you one thing as well. This is like a little glitch. So you can do this actually. Doesn't work with like stock cars, but yeah.
say you go to a car meet and you want to park it up and stuff, you just do this. And yeah guys, let's go try it on a Sylvia. Guys, just give it one second and look how many Sylvias I have. Ready? I have one, two, three, four, five, six. Six Sylvias. That's exactly how much I love Sylvias. And then I only have like three R35s and three R34s and stuff like that. Two 350s, two Fair Ladies. Alright. So it works on here. Alright, so now I'm going to show you guys the launch. So, hold the brake, hold the accelerator, and then hold the clutch, and let go of the normal. Uh, I don't know. So to do that guys, so what you're going to have to do now is hold the brake, hold the accelerator, let it go down to 2000 RPM and then hold the clutch and then hold the handbrake and then let go of the normal brake but don't let go of handbrake and then keep on tapping the handbrake as you guys can see not like that. and you can just leave it like that or if you want to do it to go higher So we are have to do is go to a completely stop, like just stopped on the road. Now what you're gonna do is rev all the way up. Okay, don't hold it. It doesn't actually go. So what you're going to have to do is see when your RPM uh, backfires. It's like rev it and see what RPM it actually backfires. Probably around 6,000 or more. Alright, so now what you're going to have to do is go really high. First gear or something. After where you want to um, the back part is, just keep on tapping the accelerator at time. Bit. Anyway guys, if you guys enjoyed that video, please smash that like button. And if you guys want more tutorials on something like that, or if you guys want me to find something out on what to do on the 
game. I can to make this car sound like that and stuff like that. Um, yeah, let me know in the comment section. Um, Yeah guys, like I said, like the video, subscribe, comment, and yeah, shout out to uh, one of my friends from school, he's actually like one of my friends from school, he like doesn't have that much subscribers, so uh, all I need you guys to do is just make him happy and go subscribe to him, alright uh, guys, his link is going to be in the description below, and yeah. Alright, thank you guys for watching, goodbye.